Hey everyone, today I wanted to talk about dealing with panic and stress because a lot of people are feeling anxious and are really panicking about what's going on in the world at the moment. And generally we get two opposite ends of the spectrum. We get those that go into complete panic and we get those that are in complete denial. And then we get people in the middle that are conscious and aware of what's going on, are taking necessary precautions, but are also trying to live life as normally as possible. So I want to talk about those people that are experiencing panic and anxiety and stress and that it's okay to be feeling this because we all deal with disruption differently. We all react and respond to it differently. So the first step that you can do is be aware of your emotions, be aware of what you're feeling and that it's okay to be feeling these things, right? So that's the first one. Second is take a deep breath. Take a couple of deep breaths if you need to. Just stop, pause, and calm down, all right? When we are in panic mode, we cannot think rationally, we cannot think logically, and we end up making impulsive or reckless decisions or reacting in ways that can actually cause more harm. So you need to calm down so that you can think logically and that you can be prepared for any or every situation possible because the more prepared you are the better you can cope and deal with situations okay and then lastly uh, choose choose how you are going to react to situations once you've sat down and planned and worked through scenarios from best case to worst case scenario um, you, ne- you then know how you're going to respond and how you're going to react to, to situations. And what this does is it gives us a sense of we have more control over life and what's happening to us instead of life just taking over and running away with us. And that's where we feel like we're out of control and we've, we start then panicking and going into fear mode. Okay, so take control of your life. Take control of where you're at and what you're feeling and put some steps in place to calm down so that you can think logically and rationally going forward as to how you are going to live your life in the next couple of weeks and or months to come because your life as you know it in terms of the normal is no longer normal right now and it may not be for the next couple of weeks or months to come.